All right, it's July 2024. Check out my screen. There's something called pocket sized ATM and it looks like an outright scam. Let's hit play on this and see what exactly is happening here. I told you guys this was going to be on the news. There was just no way on the news. And you can see here in this little like screenshot, this person put together on uh, they have a GameCube down. There. It looks like a GameCube um, <laughs> breaking news. New phone trick is making millions, but there's no company or publisher logo like CNN or Fox News or anything because it's a fake graphic. I mean, some of you probably already realize that thousands of Americans have retired early, which is already the sign this is going to be a scam. Pocket sized ATM sounds like a big scam. People are going to be making that much money and it wasn't going to go viral like this. It's absolutely insane. This is like my favorite revenge story that I've ever experienced in my life. <laughs> um, so I have two neighbors that like they both live on each side of me. So I'm like in the middle of their feud all the time. And one of the neighbors has way more money than the other neighbor, or at least he used to. Um, and he used to throw on this neighbor's face, like making fun of my neighbor for being like way less rich than him. Um, so out of spite, my neighbor didn't even want more money. Just out of spite, he's like, I'm going to find a way to make more money than you. And the guy was like, yeah, right, basically. Um, and the neighbor saw a video. Fake like, story. This has been going all around the news lately. There's like a seven minute phone trick that like older Americans who aren't tech savvy are now able to work from home on their phones and make like hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars a year doing this. And this guy literally retired a year later and he's still young and he retired like 15 years early, retired his wife to go on vacations all the time. He has way more money than the other neighbor now. And the, na the other neighbor is so, so mad. It's, it's just so, it's so beautiful. Um, and he learned it from just like a little phone trick he saw on the, the news. So they finally publicly released the video after the news, like asked them to make it public to everybody. Yes, the news. Um, if you want to check out how to finally do this, you can tap the link below. It's now available for any. You notice he said seven minute phone trick. This follows the scam pattern of always having some sort of buzz words, sort of a phrase like the, the, the five minute ice hack or the six minute water trick or the seven second, you know, prayer to manifest wealth and all these kind of like there's always a number and like a weird word and like a hack or a trick or a ritual or a recipe it's all a loophole it's all bs and so i clicked the link it went to the pocket sized atm.com seven minute trick turns my phone to a 500 dollars day atm machine but here's where things get interesting because i also saw an ad for this on tiktok and let's let's watch that ad i told you guys this was going to be on the news there was just no way people were going to be making that much money and it wasn't going to go viral like this it's absolutely insane. So, so this is the same guy, right? And this is the same intro to the video, but here comes a completely different story. How interesting. It's almost as if it's all BS, right? And this guy could have been hired, hired off of Fiverr. I don't know if he has any direct involvement with this product. Maybe he's just like a, a, a fake paid spokesperson or something like that. I don't really know. So I'm putting that out there as a disclaimer, but listen to this. He says, so my friend's mom's my friend's mom's a stay-at-home mom, and obviously we're old enough that we moved out of the house now. Um, so she's bored all the time, and she was looking to make just like a little bit of extra income, and this is freaking nuts how much money she's making off of this. But she saw in the news one day, like on the daytime talk shows, that there's like a, she called it like a, a seven-minute phone trick, where you can basically make money from your home. You don't have to be super tech-savvy or anything. You just work from home on your phone, like for like an hour a day. Um, it's freaking nuts. She made, she's made so much money that she's paying for her kids college, like all the way through college now. And she takes them on vacation like four or five times a year. Like she's retiring her husband from doing this. And it was all from like, just like this viral. What happened to the, the neighbor story? The news and it's been going viral all over Facebook and TikTok too. So after a ton of backlash, they had to make the video public. They're for both everybody BS. Um, they were reserving it just for like the ultra wealthy people to copy this. Um, but after it was on the news, basically, he keeps going. they legally had to make it open for everybody to try this. So that link below now, if you want to learn it for yourself. I told you guys this was good. Anyway, so it's all BS, right? I mean, you got him telling one story about neighbors and that's how this all, how like he got to know about it and how like it was amazing. And then suddenly his like friend's mom or some BS, whatever he was talking about, like it's just, it's, it's, a, they're lying to you up front and they're telling you that they have a way for you to make money from your phone easily. Just pay them some money. I mean, have you ever seen a more obvious scam? When you go to just the official website, it says secure your copy of the pocket sized ATM machine. And it's got something about how there's a, a, a course or a method, ebooks, courses, three hour video program, and it's a real business model, booming industry. And what else does it have here? It has a source, which doesn't make it any more legitimate. It's going to be $47, it claims. Frequently asked questions. Couldn't find any information about who is behind the product, which is not great. And then disclaimer at the bottom. Individual results may vary. Yeah, no S-H-I-T. Look at the privacy policy. I think I looked in here and did not find any company names or anything like a parent company or a person's name or a city or state 
or anything like that, which to me means maybe it's coming from like Cyprus comes to mind and I don't know that for sure, but something like that, right? I mean, I, I walked you through all this because I wanted to show you what I saw to give you, uh, it's also documents what, what was out there in case all this gets scrubbed, right? So don't get involved in this. If you did call your credit card company and say, hey, I got scammed, you know, obviously. And the, this is the same thing that you'll see with other scams, that they have some amazing offer for you. It's just going to cost you a small amount of money based upon what, you, what they say you're going to make with the product, right? Of course, you're not going to make anything with the product. It's all BS. And that is the scam. It's always a hack or a trick or a ritual or a loophole or a recipe or whatever. And it always has buzzwords, like I said, like a five minute thing or a seven minute thing or seven second, three second, 10 minute, whatever. And it's, it's not something you want to get involved in. It's the classic scam. Here's my course. I'll show you how to make money. And guess what? You're not going to make any money. And the guy who's selling you it, who is maybe sitting in, in like a nice office, like I saw this guy with glasses who was advertising a lot on YouTube like a year ago. He really, really nerdy guy. And he was like, my course. And he looked really, really super nerdy, which is not, nerds are great. I'm, I'm kind of nerdy. I don't care. But he was like really nerdy. And he had this, this corner office in this building where he shot this and someone had like the hel the camera was handheld in his videos and it made him look like he was a corner office. He was really active in his office, walking around, standing up at his desk and like, wow. But I bet he did not have any lease to that office whatsoever. And then he just shot it in there and that he claimed he made millions and now I don't see his ads anywhere. And, and, you know, it's just people trying to screw you with different schemes they come up with so they can make money. And so you can give them your money and just don't, don't do it. Right. Hit the like button down below, comment, subscribe, please subscribe. That would mean a lot to me. And, you know, tell me what you think about this in the comments down below for sure. And there is no phone trick. There is no pocket sized ATM. I wish that was real. Of course, everybody does. But, you know, if, if it, an online offer seems too good to be true, it probably is, unfortunately. And I'll take it a step further. If an online offer seems too good to be true, it is. Not probably, it is. Thank you for watching.